Paris Air Show 2017 saw the United States Army bring along one of their new build Boeing CH 47F Chinook helicopters from the 12th Combat Aviation Brigade based at Ansbach, Germany. Jane speaks to Chinook maintenance test pilot Chief Warrant Officer Chad Everett on flying and operating the latest Chinook. You're a Chinook pilot? I am a Chinook pilot. How long have you been flying Chinooks for? About 12 years. And you started off on the D model? I did start in uh, training. I flew the D model uh, later on in the test pilot course, maintenance test pilot course. I flew the D model, but most of my experience is on the 47 Fox model. And when did you start flying the Fox? 2007. Uh, I was part of the first unit equipped, and so I've flown them ever since 2007. And that was the 101st Airborne, I think, with the first unit? It was 101st Varsity, 101st Airborne. And you brought the new F model Chinook with you here to Paris? That's right. It's a MY2, uh, CH-47 Fox model. It's uh, the latest upgrades to the Fox model fleet are incorporated into this one at the factory. For the pilots, there's not a lot that feels different. Uh, the software has been upgraded in the cockpit, the glass uh, cockpit, so there's uh, some new features and there's some differences in the layout. Um, there are some additional capabilities, RNAV, that uh, we can uh, do now. And you fly day and night? We do. We fly day and night, all weather. And you've got NVG and uh, display NVG on this new model? Uh, the NVGs that we wear, we have a heads-up display that mounts onto the, to the NVG itself. And you've got bigger engines on this, I understand? Uh, these engines have uh, been around on the 47 cents of the Delta models, but uh, it is the latest, the 714 engine. Um, there are plans for upgrading the, the power plant um, coming pretty soon. And can you tell us some of the capability, the roll capabilities of the Chinook? I understand it's got a triple hook system. That's right, it has a triple hook so we can do single point, uh, external loads. We can do tandem, which is a very stable configuration. We can fly faster. Um, we can also carry a, a triple hook, three separate uh, loads, one hook to each. And uh, that comes in useful when you're flying and uh, there's a very small place to drop equipment off. You might have to drop what's on the forward hook first, reposition in the center, and then the aft hook. And I understand this model has got the roller, the internal cargo roller system. It does. It's called the Cool System, cargo onload offload system. It allows us to reconfigure the helicopter to take a pallet uh, very quickly, so we can be in flight, land, drop off passengers, take off, and uh, swap all the rollers around, land ten minutes later, and be uh, pulling up a, a pallet full of thousands of pounds of cargo. And can you tell us something about the crew? Um, composition on the Chinook in the U.S. Army? Typically uh, in uh, a garrison environment we're flying with two pilots, a flight engineer and a crew chief. Uh, if we're flying in Afghanistan or in uh, another high threat area then we'll have three um, crew members in the back, uh, a left gunner, a right gunner which is also usually the flight engineer and then uh, a crew chief that's running the ramp.